Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an issue when you're opening up Riot Games. It says your game requires a system restart to play. Please restart your computer. If the issue continues, reach out to our player support team. So you may have noticed when you're trying to sign in to the client here, and you're trying to click the play button. You may even be able to sign in, but you can't select play. You might be having this issue. So in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is close out of the Riot Games client here, and then just restart your computer. So I'm just going to right click on the start button, select shut down or sign out, and then I'm going to select restart. So now if you attempt to relaunch Valorant here, you should not be experiencing that issue any longer. Now that we've restarted our computer, attempt to open up Valorant and see if the issue has been resolved. So just go ahead and open that up here. So if you're still having this issue, one further thing we can attempt here is to right click on the taskbar, select Task Manager, and then you want to select the Startup option or Startup tab on the left side here. So Startup Apps. Where it says VG Tray, you have to go ahead and select that and then select Enable if it's currently disabled. So if it says Disabled over here, you want to go ahead and enable that. The anti-cheat system requires that it actually is enabled when you start up your computer. So, you know, take for that what you want. I mean, that's really not, you know, the best practices in my opinion. But if you've disabled that before, that's certainly a possible reason why it's not working right now. So we're going to go ahead and actually close out the Task Manager and restart our computer one more time. And now, hopefully, if you attempt to open up Valorant, the issue should have been resolved at this point. So we're just going to go ahead and wait here just to make sure it can open up successfully. So unfortunately, I'm in a virtual environment, which I guess is the third solution for your problem here, is that do not use a virtual machine to sign into Riot Games or to play Valorant at least, you will need to use real hardware. Unfortunately, that is another consequence of their anti-cheat system, unfortunately. So you might have to dual boot Windows, but you cannot run it in a virtual machine as far as I am aware. So that's one final reason you might be receiving this message. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.